The first poem is called Baby Yoga. I don't know what the babies do in Baby Yoga. A salute to the sun, the cobra, the lotus pose. The Baby Yoga website says that classes will deliver confidence, coordination, discipline. Things that babies never would achieve, apparently. <laughs> Lying about, finding their hands, sucking their toes. <laughs> The, um, this one's called um, Doris and it's about our old car, but it's called Doris. <laughs> Doris was like an auntie, upholstered, creaky, a bit loud. <laughs> Bits of her had started not to work, to fall off, <laughs> to get the rust equivalent of osteoporosis. <laughs> Good old Doris, we'd say, as she started up every day in the cold. Poor old Doris, we'd say, looking at her faded paintwork, her radio aerial snapped off long ago, the dents and scrapes, the prolapsed extrusions <laughs> trailing from her exhaust. In the end, we didn't have a choice. We had to have her taken away. <laughs> people said. They said, I expect she's gone to the bakers, to the crusher, down the Thames on the funeral barge to Essex. <laughs> no, no, we said, she's in the field with lots of other Dorises. <laughs> like animal rescue fields, high pulled horses in and a nice lady coming across with oats. <laughs> can rest and talk about the old days and the executive drivers, <laughs> the M1, the days when their trim was shining and new. No, she's not gone to that yard with the scary man and the dog and the crane with the magnet on and the cutting equipment whining all day. Not Doris, not our Doris. She's in the field. Dreaming with daisies, remembering the whistling youth who took her out, showed her off, made her go. <laughs> <laughs>